there are several different types of narrative voice. First person and third person are generally the most common and popular ways of writing stories. Let's imagine we've got a selection, we've got a box here with all different pairs of reading glasses, you know, that we, we put on our head. Um, if we were going to write a story in first person, then the glasses um, would belong to one of the characters. And we write the story from the point of view of a character, or we can write it from multiple characters. So the reader experiences the story through the eyes of that character. So all of the events in the story are told from the perspective of that character. It sounds really personal, it's intimate, it's kind of like the character is speaking directly to the reader. It also allows us to get into the, the character's mind. We can really understand how the character feels all the way through the story. So we use lots of I, we, me, us, my, our. The reader, I guess, only gets to experience the story from that character's perspective. You can, of course, write your stories in first person, but from multiple characters, the first person style. And so they, they have that level of directness and that kind of level of intimacy between the character and the reader. But this way, we also get to expose the reader to the points of view of the other characters in our story. And of course, different characters will have different perspectives to the same situation. So when we write stories which are from outside any of the characters' point of view, so it's kind of like we're spying on all the characters and we can see what's going on and we're kind of telling the reader what we can see and what is happening. We often use kind of she, he, her, his, they, it. The third person is great because it does allow us as authors to expose the reader to, to all of the characters, um, opens the hearts and minds of the different characters to the reader.